15 Feng Shui Home Office Golden Rules, Growth, Luck, and Prosperity Feng Shui is a word that you might have heard, and we're here to tell you what it means and how it manifests itself in our lives. It is an ancient art and science that was developed in China. In Mandarin Chinese, Feng stands for wind and Shui stands for water. Traditions in China believe this to mean good health. A Feng Shui home office can be a great way to make you feel more relaxed and at peace. Your office desk is your place of work, but it's also where you go for solace in the day when you're feeling stressed or overwhelmed. Feng Shui home office consultants will help you create an environment that is both productive and calming. Feng Shui for the home office is very useful and here are some rules to keep in mind. 15 Golden Rules for Better Feng Shui Home Office the rules of Feng Shui originate from the beliefs that ancient Chinese had, and have been passed down through posterity. 15 rules that you must keep in mind for your office room layout are You must have solid support i.e., no windows behind your desk. Make sure that at the back of your office desk is a solid wall. If you keep the window on the back, then the energy will stab you in the back. The door must be in the front because if the door is behind you then you will miss out on opportunities. You must not sit right in front of the door because the energy rushes toward you, you want it to slow down a little and then come to you. The power position in a Feng Shui home office is diagonally opposite the door. Southwest is called the corner of power. Sit in the southwest corner if not diagonally opposite to the door. Feng Shui desk never faces a wall as it signifies obstacles. Home office Feng Shui must not have a beam above as a beam is a symbol of oppression. It symbolizes that you are under pressure. The chairs in the Feng Shui home office must not face each other as it is a symbol of confrontation. Find your lucky direction with your Kuan number. Have a green plant in your office. Green leaves are a symbol of wealth. The Feng Shui color for the office is green so make sure that your office is painted green. According to the home office Feng Shui layout, there must not be a pillar, L-shaped desk, or edge of a wall facing you but if they are facing you then put a plant near your desk. Your home office must be far away from your bedroom, get a separate entrance for the office if possible. According to Feng Shui office decor, there must be some inspirational pictures or memorabilia in your office. Keep your office well lit and make sure that air is circulated throughout the office. Feng Shui Home Office Desk Direction According to Feng Shui, the different rooms in the house represent different areas of life. Your workplace represents your career, so special attention is required in planning this room. The most important aspect of planning this room is to keep the flow of energy your primary concern. Placement of your office desk is also important and must be placed carefully. The Feng Shui desk must be facing the door so you do not miss out on opportunities and if you want challenges place the desk at an angle, but this move could result in ups and downs so be ready to face them. If you do not want to face challenges, then place the desk parallel to the wall. Feng Shui Home Office in Bedroom Rules A bedroom home office is not a good idea as there is a lot of distraction. A bedroom is essentially a place where you wish to relax and take a nap. Having an office in that same space may negatively affect your productivity and creativity, but there is a way around it by following the given steps. Make the environment of your room work like put on the bed sheets that are more work like. When your work is done and now it's time to relax, cover your work desk. Follow these two tips to make your bedroom office combination fit for both work and sleep. Feng Shui Home Office Desk Facing Wall Feng Shui Wall Facing a Wall is not good for growth as it signifies that you are facing a lot of obstacles. This is why Feng Shui does not recommend desks facing walls, but in smaller apartments, there is no other option. So, to solve this problem we offer you the following solutions. Shifting your desk to a better position in accordance with Feng Shui is a good idea. 
shifting is the best option as it removes the problem from the root. Another thing to do is to put a feng shui picture to block the view of the wall. You can thus ensure that you are following proper feng shui rules even in relatively restricted spaces. Feng Shui Home Office Desk Facing Window Your desk facing the window is not a good symbol. If your desk is facing the windows this means that all your energy and dedication flow out of the window. If you have a desk facing a window you will find yourself looking out of the window and wishing that you were outside having fun instead of working in your home. Your desk must have a wall at the back, and it must be facing the door so that you do not miss out on any opportunities coming your way. But putting it right in front of the door is not good as you do not want all the energy to rush towards you to want it to slow down so that you can easily absorb it. This is how you must place your Feng Shui desk. Feng Shui Home Office Bagua Feng Shui Bagua, also known as Bagua or Pakua is a tool used to measure and analyze the energy of your home, office, garden, etc. Bagua in Chinese means 8 areas. In Feng Bagua, these 8 areas correspond to different parts of our life. The 8 areas of life according to Feng Shui Bagua are Health and Family Wealth and Abundance Fame and Reputation Love and Marriage Creativity and children Helpful people and blessing Career and path in life Spiritual growth and cultivation All eight of these areas have specific, characteristic feng shui elements, color, and particular connotations to the vernacular people and everyone across the world who wishes to follow this path. Feng Shui Home Office Layout Examples Green plants are a symbol of prosperity. Have some motivational quotes in the office. You must never face the wall, the wall must be behind your office desk. Put the desk in the commanding position and make sure it is diagonally opposite to the door. Have your desk should never face the window in your room. Having a window in your home office is a great thing. Lucky Feng Shui Items for Office it is important to have a Feng Shui office decor that keeps the energy at the desired level so that you get motivated to keep working in the office. Feng Shui items include some memorabilia, beautiful painting, or pictures of inspirational figures. These items help you keep working and make sure you do not face obstacles by following Feng Shui. Some office decor items that are supported by Feng Shui are Chinese coins Coins are put on calculators in the office. This is because calculators in the office are used to count money and the coin on the calculator signifies more money to count. Success Quotes These are quotes of successful people. It keeps you motivated. Landscape Painting It attracts luck and support. Hang a landscape behind you but if you are not able to hang one behind you then hang it on your right. Pagoda Tower, it is a symbol of wisdom, knowledge, and intelligence. Wealth Ship, it is a ship full of wealth. Businessmen must have it in their office as it is called Wealth Luck. Crystals, it adds earth energy to the office. It helps in making and maintaining good relationships with colleagues. Best Feng Shui Office Colors for Financial Prosperity and Success Feng Shui office color for success is green. Green is a very soothing color, it is believed to bring wealth if used in your office as said by Feng Shui masters. You can also keep green plants in your office for financial prosperity and success, especially jade plants. Green must be the go-to color in your office and home. Having green plants in your office is good in many ways as it detoxifies the office and provides a fresh and productive environment. Top Plants for Home Office Desk in Feng Shui Plants are a good sign as green is a sign of wealth and prosperity so if you have it in your office you will get good energy. Plants also keep the environment stress free and keep the air in your office fresh. Top Feng Shui Plants to have on your office desk are Fidonia, 
It is the best indoor plant for feng shui as it needs a little natural light. Aurelia, it is like a small tree and is for home offices if you need some privacy. Spatophyllo, it is a resistant indoor plant and is known as moss's cradle. Jade plant, it brings prosperity and abundance according to feng shui. Palm tree, it is a luggy plant that resists darker places. So, keep these plants on your home office desk to be able to enjoy all the benefits of these plants. Dots and don'ts for home office in feng shui. Sit diagonally opposite to the door as it gives you a position of command. The wall must be behind you and if there is a pillar paint it. The computer system must be placed in the west or north part of the room as it boosts creativity. The aquarium must be set in the north, east, or southeast direction. Have plants in your office, they signify wealth and prosperity. Do not sit in the straight line of the door as it is the path of negative energy. Do not turn your back to the door so you do not miss out on an opportunity. Make sure that your desk is not in front of a window as it distracts you. Four dot mirrors reflect the negative energy and give you control of the energy in the room. The bottom line. Feng Shui splits the whole world into these elements that encapsulate every aspect of our lives. It makes this pseudo-scientific art form extremely comprehensive and relevant in the contemporary world. It makes us soul search and finds peace. Feng Shui Home Office is one of the most important rooms in your house. It is where you spend the majority of your time, and it should be an inspiring place that makes you feel good about yourself and your work.